Real Madrid have had plenty of experience celebrating Champions League wins Saturday's 10 victory over Liverpool and Paris gave them their fifth in just nine years, and their 14th overall so the festivities back in Madrid on Sunday followed a familiar script as they added La Liga's title to the mix as well. Mercati, Madrid strengthen UCL legacy with win versus Liverpool. Ogden, Kurt Wa inspires Madrid to glory by denying Liverpool. Ali, Liverpool's UCL final loss will test mental toughness. Not to be outdone, Liverpool still had two trophies of their own to show off, the FA Cup and Carabao Cup, and were greeted by thousands of people on Merseyside to celebrate, as Liverpool Mayor Joanne Anderson put it, a team that had done us proud. Below is how both teams capped off their respective, silverware-laden seasons. Things kicked off in Liverpool at 4 p.m. BST, where open-top bus followed a nine-mile route past many of the city's landmarks and finished in the city centre. Meanwhile, Real Madrid made the next stop at Madrid City Hall. Later, he joined thousands of fans who switched to an open-top bus waiting at Sabel's, a famous fountain where fans gather to celebrate the club's frequent trophy acquisitions. Eden Hazard who already seems to be enjoying the celebration to the fullest, also had the opportunity to grab Mike and talk about his turbulent times in Bernabeu so far. On top of the bus, the players put on Real Madrid shirts that had the number 14 and champions written on the back. Karim Benzema and Marcelo shared carrying the Champions League trophy by holding a handle each while Luka Modric and Nacho Fernandez carried the La Liga trophy. I haven't slept much. I had too much adrenaline to be able to sleep, said Thibaut Courtois, Real Madrid's goalkeeper who was named man of the match in the final. I still couldn't believe it, it's an incredible feeling. For me it's an honor to play for Real Madrid and I hope I can help the team win more. The Real Madrid bus will arrive at Plaza Sabels later on Sunday, the central square at the end of Gran Via where the club traditionally celebrates its biggest titles with supporters around the Sibel's Fountain. After greeting the thousands of fans gathered in Sibeles, the players will board the bus back to Santiago Bernabeu for the closing ceremony, 